I took a couple, you know, I took some time off to rest, and now it's game time, bitches. You have no idea. And I have a little surprise. What's up, you shady gang? It's your boy, A.B. back with another hot, hot video. But before we get into today's topics make sure you subscribe hit that bell notification and like the video guys guys today we got a couple topics that we are about to get into but before we do that let's start off by shouting out our you know artists i mean our celebrities who are huku kenya that are doing great are elevating buying new stuff let's start off with carigraph jones ju amesha marisa kujenga ile nyumba yake i'm talking about the multi million Mesha, guys, Nigorofa, don't get it twisted. So, Carigraph Jones, as you can see, Nyumbayake is looking amazing. And I just want to say congratulations to him because Anaonyesha vijana wadogo kama sisi kuwa there is hope it doesn't matter where you come from you can still be successful and you know i love it let's move on and congratulate our boy david moya for you know buying nine million you know 2017 g1 guys talking about beautiful stuff i mean tiktok is paying you know he's definitely getting money money and it's not a joke and i just want to say congratulations to him because he have been doing big stuff big things you know and guys that's it that's what we have you know amazing amazing stuff let's go to some messy ass topics because you're not cool i enjoy some messy topic i enjoy being messy let's let's talk about otile brown coming for diamond neck again guys your new kuwa a couple months ago otile brown especially the diamonds fans they were calling out Otile Brown, Juari Kwaki, you know, Venyari Kwaki, Sema Manene, Watu Arikwa Nadani. Maybe there is some beef going on between them, especially Diamond fans, Jua Manene, Otile Brown. And I stand ten toe with my guy, Otile Brown. Guys, come on. So Otile Brown is speaking facts. He's confirming everything I have been telling Yokua in East Africa. We don't have an international artist. Guys, before I get messy, before we get deeper in this talk, in this, you know, in this topic, let's let's listen to what Otile Brown had to say about Diamond. Mr. Simba Chibude. Guys, people are only focusing on Diamond, but he was not even, you know, mentioning Diamond. He's talking about everybody, everyone, including himself. And I say, ma, trende kazi, you have international. And those are facts. Let's listen to what our guy got to say. Na hii international tutaipambania kwa sababu the industry is stuck. Let nobody lie to you. East Africa kuna international artist. Umenelewa. We are all sort of to make a selling. Akuna international artist East Africa. Ai. Chibude chibude. Akuna international to lo, oh, let's keep it real if you all want to keep it real. We zombie. We have to kona job ya kufanya. Haujui? Na <laughs> Tuko na job ya kufanya. For real. Umeelewa? So tusidanganye siju nini siju ma packaging kelele nyingi hapana. Tukigeda Cosmia I'm telling you kuna watoto wamekuja juzi ambao hata sirika zangu. Mi sirika yao watu kama kina ruga and all that yeah. mtoto wa juzi but hakuna msanii East Africa ambaye anaweza kushindana na ruga Unafikia. on the international level so what do i mean i'm saying this to say like East Africa tuko na job ya kufanya why is it hard not only for Kenyan artists and and even for Tanzania and Uganda, Uganda and everybody yeah. is because the ceiling ambayo inataka kuvunjwa I mean, let's do let's start embracing other music and all that kwa sababu hii bongo yetu unataka mimi naweza kuimbia hii mpaka kesho kutwa 
Hata sasa hiyo kinipa beat mzee na kupigia ngoma kali sasa hivi guys the man he speaking facts hakuna international artist in East Africa and that is the truth hakuna hakuna msanii wa huku East Africa anaweza ingia level ama kategori moja na kina Davido kina Ruge kina nani sijui anamuitaje Rema guys we don't have artists that are on that level even diamond diamond anaweza kuwa na hit in east africa anaweza pata ma views ako na do anafanya ma show but let's keep it 100 guys diamond hana nyimbo hata moja ishawai kanyaga on hot bitty board 100 trending song lakini unaona Rema Rema li spend a whole year in top 10 something nobody in East Africa has done it so diamond and a chart huku East Africa PK and in Africa we can say kwa diamond Africa he's very known he's popular but when it comes to themselves it's not there diamond akienda kufanya show huko London I bet he is not even gonna pull out 10k people. He can do that. Jana amefanya show mingi zika flop. Go see kina Rema wana Jaza Arena with 60k people inside. Guys, Otile Brown anaongea ukweli. Wanafaa wafanye kazi. Yes they have job. Yes they are popular in East Africa, but the question is are they international is their music being played kwa hizi you know radio kubwa huko dunia are we seeing kina calligraph i'm a diamond on usa mtv no are we seeing any award dai hata hakuna msanii wa huko east africa anaonekana kwa red carpet red carpet ya show za huko Yani international show I mean Grammys BT awards I'm talking about British awards Jana Rema alikuwa akiperform huko so he's definitely speaking the truth people are going to be you know they are going to drag him to the mud but we are here to support our guy he is only speaking facts and this is the reason why East African artists are not going on that level because wanaona yani fame kidogo wanajifeel kama they are on the top of the world yani wanapata 1 million followers on Instagram and they start to feeling themselves like they are Beyonce I'm a Jay Z I'm like come on wanafaa accept the truth the reality kuwa hakuna msanii wa huku East Africa huko kwa level ya international when the when the artists accept that they gonna grow because how they are st- they gonna stop putting those you know delusion thoughts in their mind that they are on that level even diamond diamond is very delusion he thinks he is on david or am i boy level and hajawai pull out them stats i'm talking about number one records on billboard i'm talking about big awards nomination i'm not even talking about winning the awards at least get a grammy nomination i did so kwa who you obina was trying to be messy bringing up diamond but it did not work otile brown is professional But guys, let's move on. Let's move on and talk about our Messias girl Zuchita because it looks like Tanasha was Zuchu karma and I'm going to tell you why, bubu. Because Zuchu venye alikuwa akijifeel, mnakumbuka venye alisainiwa kwa wasafi a lot of people including moi we did expose her for allegedly sleeping with diamond wakati diamond that ikuwa na debt tanasha and allegedly zuchu was the reason not exactly the reason because diamond was cheating with a lot of girls but zuchu was among of the reasons 
relationship ya Diamond na Tanasha kuvunjika and guess what after Zuchu Hampton that D she have been receiving troubles trouble after trouble that's why i'm telling you kuwa Tanasha she is her calma bay guys so you know kuwa walikuwa akifanya zile drama zao kuwa ameachana Zuchu alikuwa na full moon party in Zanzibar guess what ari enda kwa stage Diamond that comes surprise even though it was planned Zuchu knew everything and she start fake crying guys you know kuwa after yani wamerudiana even though they were you know creating some fake breakup but guys Zuchu alikuwa kwa hiyo show ya Zanzibar aliingia kwa stage na kaanza kujifeel na you know to these other women who are giving Diamond punani like Atam pay punani marangapi he is now leaving that what he was she was saying on stage and guess what watu wa huko Zanzibar they did not even like it even worse and they blocked her ass from going back there in Zanzibar to do a show Diamond he is always going to get this damn girl in trouble like come on zuchu zuchu nilimwambia hii drama ya diamond it's not going to help her career it's going to tarnish her image naona yani alikuwa huko stage akijifeel kwa diamond amemrudia guess what he she done fucked up her back He is now receiving the bag again. Hatafanya show huko Zanzibar. Guess what? Because of Diamond's D. Guys, it is a shame to see a grown ass woman like Zuchu fucking up her bag. I'm talking about her money because of Diamond's D. Guys, it is very shameful. It is very pitiful because Diamond he is the only one who is benefiting from it. Zuchu she is getting drag all over social media. Hata venye hiyo video ikitoka watu walikuwa wanasema that is depression. Yaani hata a cheat mara ngapi you're not going to leave him because he's your boss. Zuchu you need to have like dignity. Yaani hana yani Zuchu what is wrong with Zuchu guys? After all of that tuliona ikuja kusama ku, kuomba msamaha ka post hii leta. I was like you have already done some fucked up shit and I'm sorry for Zuchu. Zuchu she slowly slowly killing her career before even started. Zuchu hana album. Zuchu hit yake kubwa ya mwisho ilikuwa ni sukari and I feel like that is gonna be her last hit. No shade, no shade. I was thinking maybe ati nishangaza venye sukari ilikuwa nyimbo kubwa. Na hai ku trend huko America in hot bitty bod. I'm like are they buying fake like are they buying fake streams? because guys diamond and apata streams mob but in ashanga haezi ingia kwa chat za huko USA or international i'm talking about spotify globally i'm talking about apple music globally i feel like at least have one song trend on apple music globally because you got them streams you got 100 100 billion streams but yet hakuna nyimbo yake na trend it is very questionable i feel like they do fake some shit and guys to be quite honest let's watch this video azuchu akiomba msama and to be quite honest guys i feel like i'm done with this i'm done i'm tired And let's watch this video. Habari wa Tanzania kwa majina naitwa Zuhura Othman Sud al-maarufu kama Zuchu kupitia baraza la sanaa la Tanzania Basata kwanza nianze kwa kuwashukuru walezi wetu kwa kuniita jana na kufanya kikao na mimi cha kunipa maelekezo na muongozo sahihi ya jinsi ya kufanya sanaa yangu bila kukiuka tamaduni na desturi zetu za Tanzania. 
Hivyo basi kutokana na sisi tofahamu iliyojitokeza siku ya tarehe 24 kwenye show yangu ya Zanzibar pale Kendwa niombe radhi kwa jamii kama kuna sisi tofahamu yoyote imejitokeza na kama kuna mtu yoyote ama mlengo yoyote imemkera lengo lilikuwa ni kuburudisha na sio kupotosha maana niombe radhi tena kwa walezi wangu wa baraza la sanaa basata maana wao wamekuwa mchango mkubwa wa kutulea sisi na kutuongoza vizuri na kutuelekeza kitu kutuka maadili yetu na shukuru kwa kikao kilichofanyika ikiwa kama kosa la kwanza na kunipa sikio la kujielezea na kunitetea na shukuru sana baraza la But guys the sad part is that Zuchu she is a beautiful young woman with a lot i mean with the she got a lot. she she is very very talented and she still got a you know i don't but guys let's be honest she's very talented she's beautiful wakati zuchu alikuwa kianza i was hoping i was like I thought she was gonna be the next it girl when it's come to the female artists in East Africa because Sukari was going far, was reaching a lot of countries. But after that, he went down. Like, no other hit. Guys, that's what I have for you today. Jump in the comments, tell me your thoughts. Make sure you subscribe, hit the bell notification. I'm gonna see you in the next video. I took a couple, you know, I took some time off to rest, and now it's game time, bitches. You have no idea. And I have a little surprise.